Welcome to another Save Your Books video. This one is about recasing a typical daily Bible. So the book came to me like this. It was already separated and the end sheets are still intact. So it's kind of like, do we save them? Can we save them? In this case, we are going to attempt to save them and see what happens. I'm hoping to save them, to just not have to um, redo anything here and make new hinges. Um, so this is this will be a fairly fairly fast repair. First thing we're going to do is to clean the spine off. So I'm just getting some boards to put around the book so I can pinch it because I want to be able to work on the back. And now I have to wait about 15 minutes before I want to even try and scrape that off. All right, so Clusal, and then, then we can think about the coloring. And I happen to have two colors that when blended should approximate this color. Nice and shiny. The interesting thing about this cover is that the leather that is here was put on over some kind of cloth because all the edges are holding up because of the original cloth that's underneath there. And the leather is just kind of stuck on top. So that's why this has lasted so long. It's a really good quality Bible from whenever this was published. So it's been about 20 minutes and now I can scrape the next layer off. Anyway, that is pretty good. Uh, you want to pay special attention to the first one eighth of an inch on the edges because if those aren't scraped off and you're trying to attach new glue to those areas, it won't stick and it'll just cause problems. Um, whereas if there's a little bit of old glue in the middle, it kind of holds it all together. But the edges you really want to be attached. And now I can just let that dry before I do the next thing, which will actually be to um, put the ribbon back on and then the end bands. Okay, so I'm going to take this out and so I'm going to do one liner that goes in between the end bands because the end bands have a thickness. So I'm going to fill in the space, that gap. Okay, so we're just going to make a hollow that has one on and two off. There we go. Slide that on, slide this over. There is our hollow. So, I am now going to attach the cover to the text block. This is the first step of casing this book in. And all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna glue this and I'm gonna glue this. I'm gonna glue the text spine and the cover spine, or the case spine. I'm trying to line it up so that the end bands are definitely fitting inside. And as tucked into place as possible and just let that dry. But you really do have to babysit it and Kind of press on it, make sure that those attach. There we go. Let's just see how it's looking here. There you go. This mull needs to come onto the cover and then this needs to get glued in and then you won't have this mull sticking out here. Right, and now to line this back up with the page and just have this be glued here, I can just glue this down. So I can glue this
Great, this does seem to be working out. Just putting it in place. So there you have it, recasing a Bible. Very sturdy now.